homies, it's your girl Candy, and we are out here at the 2016 BET Hip Hop Awards. So you know it's about to be lit, right? We have performances from Gucci Man, Young Thug, and so much more. So sit back, relax, take your shoes off, and enjoy the show. Some words of encouragement that you would tell people to get out and get involved. Well, a lot of reasons uh, people are dissatisfied is because of the representation and the policy that's not being passed or is being passed that doesn't change their everyday life. We're in a transformative time in this country, very tumultuous. And if you don't participate in the process, then you can't impact it, you can't influence it. And if enough of us vote, then these representatives will have to eventually vote our way with our ideals, with our concepts, otherwise we throw them out of office. So that doesn't just include a national election, we're talking locally as well, midterms, statewide, get involved in the process. The trickery is saying my vote won't matter and it doesn't count. When you believe that, it's how you're going to affect change in politics. So, to me, that's what the importance is. Right. What Tracy and Heather think <laughs> to be totally different. That? Yes. Y'all would agree with Absolutely. that? Absolutely. And just to extend on that, you have to find out what's important to you. You know, you see kids lined up, spending the night overnight in front of Foot Locker and Champs and all these stores for sneakers that's coming out. You have to line up in front of these polls. And as Sway mentioned, whether it's the mayor or the senator, the governor, ask any kid do they know who their mayor is or their local borough president or the governor or the senator. They don't know, but they can tell you when the next edition of a sneaker is coming out. Something is wrong with that psyche. So you have to decide what's important to you. And whether you don't vote or not, whatever whoever gets in that office, you're going to have to play by those rules. So you might as well get out there and have a voice in it. Absolutely. I have a random question for y'all. Empire or power? Sheesh! Empire or power? Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm so split in the center with this. Only because I've watched more episodes of Empire. That's why I'm going to say that. And I freaking love Taraji. She is like the best friend in my phone, even though I don't actually have her number. I feel like I can dial her up anytime. So, Taraji, I love you. All right. Her loyalty is with you, too. Empire? Well, I did do two seasons of Empire, so I might be slightly biased. Okay. I'm going to end it right there. Uh, okay, okay, okay. We're going to ask you how you feel. Congratulations on your song, Rocket on the Fun. How you feel about that? I feel blessed. Exciting. So let me ask you. Now you remember back when, when Beyonce played your song and everything. So is there anything coming up there? Did y'all get to link up? What's going on? I, I, I definitely met Queen, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you know, she, she's been a, a very big help in, in putting other people on to, uh, to, to my sound or whatever. Like, she, she, she linked me with Mike Will as well as Diplo. I'm saying, I met with her, whatever, little things like that. I got nothing but love for Queen. Yo, 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 what it do? It's your boy, Big Baby Drum. You know, I'm already stepping into the shade room. Keep it locked, y'all. Spread that love. Stop being so shady. Jadena, fresh off of dropping your new single. Yeah, yeah. You, right? So, what, what do we have to look forward to on your new project? I think that I, I don't make the same song 14 times in a row. Okay. So I think there's a lot of artists that do. That's good for them, but I don't feel the same every day. Some days I feel on top of the world. Other days the world's on top of me. So that's what you're going to hear on the project. What's up, G? So let me ask you. I know you're a classic man, right? But is there any, yes. is there, is there any time you ever get a little ratchet sometimes? Being a classic man don't mean you're not a ratchet man, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> no. It's a balance problem. Yeah, there's got to be a balance. Balance, man. The whole point of wearing the suits is because you can get away with anything. I don't, I don't get. Yeah, that's that's the whole point. I, you can't. I said certain words in that record eight, ten times. It had to be bleeped out. That's a hint to everybody that keep your gloves dirty with your hands clean. Message. Message. What up, y'all? I'm Jadena, and I'm stepping into the shade. Room. Prima Donna, and you still have that. I'm just as married now. Yes, as married. As married. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Happy, happy, happy. Yeah, yeah. How y'all doing? 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 How y'
record, for the record. It's your girl Prima Donnie. You know I had to step into the shade room because y'all know it's hot out here. But so I had to get a little shade. And y'all step out the comments hating with all of that. Go get you some paper, get you some money. Cause I would never care. What you thought? So we're here with Demetrius Junior. So you gotta tell us how was it? Drop it right now. Benny see it on this He's amazing. He's a great guy. He's been in this industry a long time. So got a whole bunch of game for Benny. Oh, oh, oh! Was it hard for you to be trained? Hard for me to portray. It was. I've been working. Shout out Angela Gibbs, she's an amazing acting coach. You want to act? Oh, no, no. I'm, I'm telling you, I promise you, you need to holler at her. Now, let me before you got into this, did you always get the comparisons? Like, oh, you look like Fox. Yeah. yeah. High yeah. school, work, I got called Fox. Like, that was my name. That was it. I wouldn't did you get called see it, my though? first name, Fox. No. No. I mean, I, I sometimes don't see it still. Right. Now, they get our podcast. So, let me ask you, do you think he's still alive? Is he wandering around? Let me ask you, you know they got a whole bunch going on with um, the Super Bowl, who's going to be performing? Who do you think gonna, will be better? Gaga, Drake, Rihanna, Dad. Kanye West? Chris Brown. Oh, okay, you're going to write it in. They should have. They should have had Chris Brown. He's, he's one of the greatest performers to ever come. You know what I'm saying? It's like Beyonce, Chris Brown, and then who else? Uh, Chris Brown, Demetrius Shield Jr. stepping into the shade room with the hip hop world. What's happening? Shout out to uh, Puff for um, blessing me, man. You know, he seen me and he was like, you know, holiday. I think he's a new one. I, I think I need to put him in the game. So ever since he put his arm around me, I know, and on top of that, he did bring me out for the Bad Boy reunion tour a couple days ago. Pimp Serena, in front of thirty thousand. Ain't that but, but I had fun though. But y'all, shout out to Puff and shout out to Ciroc for holding me down, man. Shout out to Ciroc Mango. It's really good too. Is it really good? So rock loco is good. <laughs> let me ask you. So for the Super Bowl, there's been ramblings about it maybe. Gaga. But well, let me ask you. Do you think it would be Gaga, Kanye West, Drake, or Rihanna? Which one would put on the better show? Uh, Drake, my partner. So. What's up, Drake? Drake. I mean, Drake and Rihanna would be dope. And they love and shit. Right. Yeah, <laughs> Got that whole couple thing. Yeah, man. They can do a couple records together. He can do five. She can do five. It's dope. Yeah, it's dope. So if they use that, that was your idea. Exactly. Drake, you know what it is. I'll bring it. Shade room, you know what it is, man. DJ out of that commission, God makes take king. I fuck with y'all, man. Turn up, you in the shade room. Shade, I need some shade with that hot ass jack. A random question for you. What it is? Empire or power? Both on hard. Both on hard. I don't know. I like both on. I ain't, I can't even pick. I can't even pick both on. I like both on. You like them both. I like both. Equal. Yo, what up, man? Well, it's man, the kid daddy. Right now, stepping into the shade room. What's that? Do you know all the languages that you use you know, to write that song? I don't know them fluently. I'm very familiar with them. And you know, I tell, I, I, I've been telling people this, and it's true. Just off the fact that where I reside or where I was, where I was living at the time, Miami, where I'm from, South Florida period, everybody moves there. It's the melting pot. So, you know, those are the common greetings, you know, that, that I, could, I could call off the top of my head. If I were to see somebody from somewhere, I'd be able to shoot real quick. Right. So you just know how to say, hey, what's up? Yeah. All right. That's all that matters. Yeah. After that, you can get where you got to go after that. So, power or empire? I don't watch none of them shows. Oh, uh, well, there you go. <laughs> you got it. Can't get no much really than that. Her power was a thing. You know, I just don't, I never had time to sit down and watch yeah, TV. Yeah, I got to get caught. You know, gotcha. and when I do have time to sit down, I ain't trying to watch no TV. Working. Yeah. It's Bobby Tennis, Cat Jones, you know the rest. I'm locked in right now. The shade room. Don't go nowhere else. We're here with Amigos. How y'all doing? Yeah, what's happening? Yeah, we're here. You know? So congrats on signing with Kanye. How y'all feel about that? Shout out to Kanye. You know what I mean? We ain't every, everything ain't done yet, so you know what I mean? It's, that's family. That's gang, 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 gang. All the way. We, we 1,000. We hood. So you know, you see us acting and still showing out, yeah. showing you another side of the Migos. Y'all venturing into more things y'all gonna do with the acting? Yeah, we venturing into that way. So when's 
the next album coming out? When will we get some shit? Bringing it back home. Alright, that's what's up. Alright. Congratulations. Hey, 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 hey. Um, somebody being a new uncle? For real. Yeah. Everybody's here. What's up, man? Everybody. We in the shade room. Chef, what's happening? All this ice in the shade room. Yeah, man. Uh-huh. Ain't no shade. Cause we having it on us. Yeah. yeah. Young and man, I'm stepping into the shade room. With the dream, how you doing? Bam! I'm doing good. I feel good. Well, congrats to the baby. Thank you. Hold on, we gonna talk. Love being a daddy. Go ahead and introduce. Of course. Right. That's, the, that's the soul of my life. You done? You having any more? Um, definitely, probably am. Yeah. Yeah. So when you grow up by yourself, I think it's just a thing. I like guess you surround, like you know. I, I want that. I see that picture of me in my bed if I'm passing away, and I just have these people who love me because they love me, not because you know. Because of who I am. That's just the So let me ask you, what, what's coming out? Do you have you love affair? Love affair is coming out. It's done. Everybody's saying love affairs, the dreams detox. It's not. So it's coming out. Coming out. It's coming out. When? Top of the year. Top of the year. Mm -hmm. All right, so when's the, the, the first single dropping the top of the year? We got, like, actually, we got a, a, a pre single. We have a record that was started here in Atlanta called Lemon Lean. And I just literally played it for a friend of mine um, on the radio station. We just went down because I live here, played the record. <laughs> And the phone lines lit up about the record because it showed a different point of view. Um, since Beyonce killed the year, it, it showed a different point of view from from a male's perspective, and I think um, everybody kind of gravitated towards that. All right, let me. I got a random question. Okay. That's hard. But power is on my thing right now. I love power. Yeah, yeah. It's good. It's good. It's good. Power is really good, man. It's really good. They don't want me on that TV, man. I'm too, I'm too real for TV, baby. They don't want me on that. Yo, what's up? This is the American Dream. You know what it is. I'm stepping into the shade room. Oh, it's crazy. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, it's part two of the get down, and uh, we're filming. It's the last 30 days of the shoot. It should be coming out top of the year in January. It's lit. Shaolin is crazy. Like he, it's a whole new. It's gonna be dope. It's gonna be our favorite show. It's our favorite, favorite part of the season. All that. Yeah. Everybody, make sure to tune in and check that out. Tune in. Netflix coming soon. What's going on? I'm Shamik Moore, and I'm stepping into the shade. So you can give us some insight. What's going on with the new season? Can you give us anything? We got literally four days until we drop. All I'm going to say is, y'all don't want to miss that first episode. You do not. It's nothing. I, all I can tell you is that I'm a little locked up, but I'm on my way home, baby. You coming back Yeah, now? I'm on my way home. Okay. Yes. You can Okay. She said don't miss that first episode. Don't. That, you that don't. First one. That's you don't. Major. Because a lot of your answers. It's in that first episode. September 21st, Wednesday. What up? It's Breezy. We live. B T Hip Hop Awards 2016, and you are stepping into the shade room. Yeah. We're here with Yandy and Bianca. How y'all doing? I'm good. How you doing? Thank you very much. Let's do a spin. Hey. Let's do a spin. 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 Let's do a spin
It's a shade room. Shade room popping your Yep, yep. Hey, yo, what's poppin'? It's your girl Cardi B and I'm in the shade room. Y'all better never talk shit about me, alright? Cause y'all bitches in real life is pussy. Bye. <laughs>